All right. So you know about the bioluminescent fungus. You know the. Uh, you can see the sort of lamp posts that give off a glow similar to fairy fire, uh, like the spell. It's purples and blues and stuff like that. <clears throat> and this cave, this this opening is immense. Uh, you cannot see like. Looking up, because the light gives you a little bit further distance that you can see, uh, you cannot see the ceiling. It goes up into darkness. <clears throat> uh, you can actually see up there, you can see little like points of light, probably bats or something along those lines. Uh, <clears throat> and in the center of the city, because the path that you're taking, which is you're heading north through the city. Uh, in in the center is a stalagmite where the top has been completely removed, and it's a huge one, uh, and it has all these different openings in it and the like. Uh, it's very uh, elliptical in terms of its shape. It could be like a, a council area, maybe an arena, something along those lines. Like it's, it's, it's a pretty good size. Off to the side, <coughs> to, to the east, to your right, essentially, uh, there is a, uh, it's not as big as the central building, but <coughs> it's what is essentially a very large skull. And how large are we talking? Uh, it's, it's And is it it's, an actual it's, skull, a carved? It's shaped stone. Okay. Yeah, it's not an actual skull, as far as you can tell. Uh, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> and it's a pretty fair question, just in case. Yeah. No, <laughs> it is. It is a fair question. The eyes, in in the eyes, you can see light, and there are things like uh, you see, like an, an altar in there, and there's some. There's a desk and some things like that. Um, and where the jaw is, the lower teeth, so to speak, have been removed. And there's like a staircase up into the skull proper. This is the temple to Chaldea. <clears throat> uh, the skull itself is stone, but it seems to have been painted uh, white-ish. And there are runes carved into it that glow faintly green. Uh, you're, you're sort of escorted up to the door and the person who's leading you knocks on the door and is answered by a answered by a death elf whose name I will find in just a moment. Give me just a second. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Just following us in the alleys? Or? Just being sneaky and shit. <laughs> yeah, we're just sneaking around. Don't mind me. That's what I'm doing. Okay. It's a female death elf in uh, black robes who has a very nasty looking mace that is that has kind of a skull motif on it, and the spikes from the mace come out of the eyes and out of the back of the head. Well, that's pleasant. One out of the top. <laughs> it looks pretty I'm, rad. I'm, I'm in a weird anyway. Uh, I didn't do that. She seems to have known that you were coming. And addresses you in common. Okay, so I can understand. You can understand this. It is, uh, I don't know that we've ever had, uh, it's been a century or more since we've had our last, uh, visitor, visitor overlander, I got you, uh, surface dweller, that's the word I was looking for. Uh, my name is Alisaria. Welcome to the Temple of Chaldea. 
Are you familiar with Chaldea? <coughs> I'm a bit familiar with Chaldea, yes. Oh, excellent, excellent. And your uh, companion is blind? Yes? Yes. Hmm. We can fix that. Can you? Oh, God. Yes. That would be absolutely lovely. <laughs> 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 hey, guys, say hi to our viewers. We have eight of them. Oh, hello. Hello, <laughs> viewers. Nice. One of them is a uh, person who came back. Welcome yes. back. Ms. Welcome Jay. back. Ms. Jay. Is that the Australian person? I, I think, think it is, it. but I can't remember. Okay. Quick, if somebody we're being say very something. mean or intolerant, I mean, I'm sorry. We just don't remember. It's been a long time. Yeah. Yes. Do we have the one from Australia or the one from Britain? So is how would Britain? that work Britain, Britain, if we had the uh, Death Elves restore Rand's vision? I can end that illusion of my eyes anytime I want to. Well, we remember so. the I, name. I don't know if they'd be able to sense it, and we're not going to find out until they did try it. Which is just know that if you're exposed as a liar, I, I'm not backing you up. <laughs> and, and you are, uh, from what I understand, and you actually notice that while you're talking, she is making very intricate hands hands gestures um, that are similar-ish to the ones used by the by by the thieves. Can't. So would they I have their own to... thieves can't? Yeah. It's like American sign language and Spanish sign language. Well, right, right. Would I be able to interpret anything from these hand movements? You can pick up a few. Like, you can tell. <coughs> uh, give me a wisdom. No, give me an intelligence check. <laughs> those those are those bad. Are be... Well, yeah. no, intelligence I've actually boosted a little bit. but So that's 14. Yeah, 14, okay. okay. <laughs> so... You can pick up that it's just conversational. Like, it doesn't seem to be hostile in any way. Like, she's just gathering information from the people that are with The guards like, behind yeah, us. Yeah. Like, yeah. The that, are, that are with you. <clears throat> so and I just pretend to scratch my ear, and at the time I'm activating the earring and letting everybody know that you uh, watch their hands. They seem to have some kind of sign language. So you are here seeking information about your family. <clears throat> yes. My aunt and uncle were murdered along with everyone in our town um, a few years ago. And that's what took me to the temple of Gaia and where I began to heal, but I need more uh, answers. Yes, Gaia. Yes. Uh, I'm sorry. It's Gaia, not Gaia. Okay. I was. I didn't have it in my brain at the time. I told you what it was. G A I U S. It doesn't matter. Doesn't really. Uh, <clears throat> ah, yes. You follow the god of life. Mm -hmm. We have. We understand the need for balance and welcome you as such. Um, without life, there can be no death. And thus, we understand the need for both. What is the uh, name of the place? This is her asking. Yes, um, that's a really great question. Where, where, where did this happen? I have it. And Check my records. No, like let's pretend that I knew it off the top of my head. If no, I I understand. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um. Vandar, right? Vandar. That's what we said. Vandar. Yeah, okay. Vandar. V a n d a r. Mm -hmm. That's the ruins. Okay. Got yes. It. A few years ago. How many years ago? How old am I now? That's up to you. <laughs> that would be 14 like levels. So it's 30, probably, I'm 30 it's now. probably been a couple years. That's what it's I probably been a while. So seven, seven I didn't years. Think about how old we are. Yeah, as I was retyping my characters, you I just aged myself two years. Like Rand started at this when he seven was like years ago. seventeen. So. Please come in. 
uh, <coughs> you actually, so we were both invited. In. Two years, is that what you Bark is, of course, oh, super excited. Yeah. Kind of looking at everything. I'm having to like rein him in from sniffing at a lot of things. Well, if he <laughs> runs off course, I rein him in so not to be like, oh, I can see everything. Okay. <laughs> um, your, your, uh, I'm terribly sorry, I your name. Antinua. Antinua. And this is Rand, and his furry companion is Bark. Bark. Oh, Rand. A halfling. Not seen a halfling since... Well, that's not going to do that. Despite uh, his condition, he's very good at carrying things. That is surprising, <laughs> considering his size. <laughs> I haven't seen much. Of, I haven't seen much of anything in a long time, sire. But me and my so while they're having me and my buddy doing pretty it, right? well. Because uh, I imagine mm, they have to think about it. Yes. This yes. is this is good shit right here. This is real good shit. Uh, give me All your right. stealth check, both of you. Sure. <clears throat> and I'll be enough. Mm -hmm. It's enough. What's the total? I roll a seventeen. I get plus fourteen. So thirty something. Yeah. 25. Okay. 25 for you. Okay. <laughs> got it. The time I rolled a 10, I didn't have to call the 10. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. Uh, I rolled a natural 20 on the yeah. <laughs> Well, here we go. So we'll get to what that means in a little bit. Okay. And we'll do some more of this first. <laughs> <laughs> so you're invited in to, like, further into the temple. Uh, and you see that. There are a few like rows of stone pews, uh, and there's kind of an altar <coughs> at the far end from the door. Uh, on the altar, there are a number of implements and grooves into the altar uh, that could potentially be used for uh, sacrifice or the like. There's also a Uh, shel shelving on the far wall that has a series of vials on it that are of different colors and, and levels of glow as far as how much uh, how magical they are. Give me a nature check. <laughs> okay. Well. Also, do you know... Uh, why churches are like churches are like lasers? Pew pew pew. Jesse, ten. <laughs> punch, Dave. Oh, punch. <laughs> ten. Ten. Okay. Oh well, that's nice. Um, do I get anything on nature? Oh, somehow I do. So nine. Okay. <laughs> so nine and ten. Hmm. Uh, yeah, actually, no, that's you. That <laughs> you, you were not really sure what are in, like, what the vials contain. Just that they're faintly magical. Now, you obviously can't. You can actually see in here. Yeah, there's uh, lighting enough. That you yeah, can I'm see still kind of looking at the ground. Yeah. Like I don't, but I can see. Yeah. yeah. Um, would you want us to assist Rand first, or? I would like to leave that up to Rand. Huh. Rand, generally, uh, servants obey their overseers, and they will, uh, he will do as you wish. Right. That's why we ask you. But just, just as there is a balance between life and death, there's a balance between, um, <laughs> let me pull that in. No, do it, do it. Yes, there's, there's, a, there's a balance between master and servant, and um, he's been without his sight for so long that I am not sure that his frail heart could stand to see the beauty of the Underdark. Interesting point of view. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Rand. Would you like and uh, okay. would you like your vision back? Please take it. Can you even upgrade? I really want to know what happens. <laughs> because normally, 
people of your nature, of your kind, swear if you ate it, it's literally the have first. trouble seeing in the dark. That is easily yeah. fixed. I haven't seen for so long, says. Why am I suddenly? <laughs> <laughs> no, do it. Yeah. I haven't. I haven't seen for so long, says. I. I don't know if I could handle it, but. I sound like Pip from Great Expectations. <laughs> hey, it never works. Please, sir, I want some more vision. <laughs> if you had just offered me just my normal sight chimney back, snake. I might not have taken it. I honestly don't know if I could have handled it, but you say you could actually improve it. Then yes. It'll help you. Now, I've been raised to believe that nothing comes shoes. for free. Mm. Where, why would... I'll do what it for would I proper. need to have for you to do this? Hmm. That's a good question. That is an excellent question. <laughs> We do not require anything of you. Your we have here many servants, and as you were like walking through the city, there were a multitude of different races other than death elves that sort of meandered about the city: goblins, orcs. Humans, a few humans, etc. Uh, we have many different types of servants, and they, uh, in order to serve us better, they uh, we have granted them the ability to see as we do, to have uh, dark vision. Oh snap! Randir, I actually I think I know how you can repay. And you can better serve your master. With this renewed ability, I allow Rand to carry a purse of my money as part of this balance He's between master and servant. She's gonna find and a way to make me pay out of my own money. And I would be more than happy to um, give a donation to the temple of. Um, 10,000 10, gold. That is, that is very generous. <laughs> However, uh, we, we don't really require much by way of money. Do you oh, have know. any exotic mm. uh, surface items? Oh, I did just made? get a wonderful ring. Um. <laughs> you don't know about that. Hey, we, you, know, you, don't, you don't know about the, that I have the ring. Because <laughs> <laughs> I, I pilfered that one. I know he has a ring, though, right? You know I have yours. Yeah. Rand you don't know dear. about my second ring. <laughs> she doesn't know about either of them. Rand dear, would you would you care to turn out your pockets so that I can figure out what oh. would be a suitable, a suitable oh, donation shit. to the temple? <laughs> Rand. Man, how does it feel to be someone's bitch? I like that that's in character, too. <laughs> it's the first time I've smiled since I've been back. Um, now come yeah, on, I, make I, I, some... I don't want the seven piece anymore. I, I'm good to go home. I don't want to go home. Chop, chop. Well, uh, Ran turns out his pockets. And really, the only thing in his pockets, because that's not, he would be carrying a purse, a money purse for his money, but he does have the ring, two daggers just kind of plop out. He's got, he's got so like regular daggers. daggers. Uh, yeah, he, he has like 18 daggers, he's just like daggers on him all the time. What does the ring do? It's just a ring of feather balling. But we don't what know that. Too? We it really don't know what it does. Fall slower. Uh, okay. like, we don't know what it does, but you know it looks exactly like the other The one. same other ring. And I out of character, yeah. that's what it is, right? Yeah. yeah. So it you is have two basically that just alike. It's yeah. a ring that removes falling damage. Since, so you don't have to worry about falling damage. Since Dave, you can give up one. Rand stole well, I know, it, and I even though I don't that. know that he pilfered it, I think that the powers of karma would make it such that he offered them that ring, and that's what I want to do. Rand, dear, please, please give, um, what's her name again? Alisaria. 
Randir, please give Alisaria the ring. Yes, mistress. And no, he you offers say it like you mean it. And he offers up the ring. Still just kind of gazing off into the distance. But he's looking at what's okay. the character name? Antinua. Antinua. Like, <laughs> I still look at Milky White, but his face is just like, yes, give, mistress. Give me a deception check. Me? Yeah. Oh, uh, this. Call? Well, I have plus mm. eight, so. It, 19. It's for Damn. a specific reason. Okay, cool. Very good. <laughs> they did not pick up on the. On the uh, fact that I was a little the angry light, there. Like angry, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, that's so funny. A ring, uh, a ring of feather falling. Wait, which one did you give her? Always useful. The new one. The new one? Yeah, the pocket. new one, because that was the one that this was in my pocket. This design, design I am, I yeah, am in my not pack, intimately yeah. familiar with. Our uh, Death Elf design is a little bit different, so this is an excellent gift. Thank you. Oh, you're very welcome. Uh, she... You're gonna pay for that. <laughs> Mentally. That's the earrings. Bring it, bitch. I heal your ass. <laughs> she, uh, she pulls out... And you've seen this before. It's actually uh, kind of like an Artec pen that is used for enchanting items and the like. You know? Uh, she... She approaches you. And she goes to pull the blindfold off of your face uh, which is illusory well I had n well I didn't have a blindfold oh, on my eyes were just milky, milky white, white. Okay, yeah. right, right. she walks up to you with the tip of the pin glowing nicely uh, close your eyes just the tip I close just my eyes and even the, I'm not since I'm not proficient in arcana but since I'm a spellcaster, would I know about when a spell would actually be supposed to take effect? Uh, yes. Why? Because if she's doing, if she's <laughs> actually trying to heal me, give I want me, to end the illusion. Give me an insight. Give me an insight <laughs> check. Why did you ask for that? Because you're trying to see if... Because you're if, the one who's being too okay. specific. You're, you're trying to see if Rand would believe that there was foul play. What is he roll shitty? Six. Six. Straight <laughs> six. You can no bonus. No, not to insight. All right. I have no wisdom bonus. Oh, my God. Um, you can... From, from what you can tell, she seems to be... No. Genuinely okay, interested in helping, okay, like like with. you're not getting any any weird vibes. Okay. Well, I still I close my eyes and okay. I wait for whatever's about to happen. And you feel some light light pressure as some 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 runes are drawn on your eyelids. And I'm guessing that uh, so the glow of the runes fade. And you now have superior dark vision. And I end the illusion. You're in the illusion yes. before you open them? Yes, Rand okay. ends the illusion. And then... Uh, and your eyes actually become more... Like, there are more flecks of red. Okay. What is it with Rand and his eyes and, changing all the time? Yeah, pupils. And you have... You now have superior dark vision, which gives you dark vision out to 120 feet. Holy shit. I'm okay with this. This works. I only have dark vision 60. 30. 60? Is it 60? Mm -hmm. 60. Hmm. 120, you said? 120 feet, yeah. yeah. That'll be wonderful. Thank you so much. Rand opens his eyes. Does she say anything else, or is it just... Okay. No. She Rand... kind of backs up. She she, she, she pockets the, the, the Artec pen again. Uh, I'm going to make a note, actually. I have a cool idea for... A class that uses the Artec pen for various purposes. I if it if we're having the same kind general idea, I want to talk to you about that. <laughs> but, okay. <laughs> but uh, Rand opens his eyes and he slides off Bark and falls down to the ground. He's like, I can see, it's beautiful. It's Bark, beautiful. Bark is like, you always and, could uh, Rand like snaps his <laughs> hand over, pretending to pet his dog, yeah. but just holding. <laughs> his his He's like. Bark, you beautiful creature! Thank yeah, you for helping me. Yeah. And he's just holding his yeah. muzzle. Shut post. up! Shut up! Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. Bark is Bark is like 
But you could always. Yes, Mark, I could always love you this much. <laughs> That's our time. Alright, awesome. That's a good place to end one video. <laughs>